Thank you very much, Courtney. What a way for the Gold Eyes to kick things off at home. That is going to be a fantastic game. Looking forward to tonight. Our buddy Drew Coase update today is looking forward to Pride Parade Winnipeg as he spent a little bit of time with Half Pints. Look at their association with Pride Winnipeg. Good morning, Drew. Good morning, Jeremy. A very fun way to celebrate, get in the spirit, is to sample this delicious beer we have, the Queer Beer. It is fruity, it is fabulous, and it is a limited supply. So you want to act now if you want to be able to pick up one of these uh, packs of six bottles before they're all gone. Yeah, because it's been a couple of years now between uh, with Half Pints making the Queer Beer, and every single year they more, make more, and every single year they sell it. I know, that's the thing too, because it's so coveted, it is so delicious, it sells out so quick. So by the end of this week, you probably won't be able to buy any more in the stores, but don't worry, there will be plenty in the beer tent at the Pride Parade, so you'll be covered that way. Okay, now we're going to want to start with a little something for everybody, which is how to make the perfect pour. You have some that, experience in the field. Uh, I would say that you also were uh, pretty good at this, but we're going to be talking to the export here, or expert here. Uh, Nicole, Jeremy was asking about the perfect pour. Uh, thanks, about, first of all, for having us down here, and you're, you're going to educate me on the perfect pour. We've got our delicious half pints glass, and we've got this special type of beer. What do we got here? This is our Sir Stick Stout. Is that, it's actually a stout that we infuse with locally roasted coffee from uh, a local coffee roaster. and. Let's go open it up here. Okay, now to, what do we need to know? What's the most crucial part here? Kind of put it on an angle to start and then tip the glass up the higher it fills. You want to get a nice, nice looking Whoa. head on that. Oh, that's there perfect. There you go. You have clearly done that before. I've been around the block, yeah. Okay, so I like the technique. We keep it bent and we're pouring, we're pouring, we're pouring, then tilt it up because you want to make sure you're getting just the right amount of bubbly head on top of it. Looks there. delicious, right? Okay, and this was the coffee beer, uh, a great beer to be uh, pouring first thing in the <laughs> first morning. First thing in the morning, absolutely. But, but for those uh, any times, those special occasions, you guys very recently celebrated a pretty big honor. So we can sample a gold and silver award-winning beer that was recognized on a national level, right? Yes, yes, we're very proud to have been uh, participated and uh, won some awards at the Canadian Brewing Awards. It was held this year in Victoria, BC, and we came back home with our most popular beer that we sell at the breweries, our St. James Pale Ale. Okay. We're a brewery in St. James, so why not do the St. James? And we won a silver award for that. All right. And we also have our Pothole Porter is a seasonal beer that's just, there's a few bottles left at some of the liquor marts around town. And we won a gold medal for that, for the porter style. No kidding. So who did we beat out? And I say we. <laughs> uh, now now we're like all in the same uh, pool on this one. So right. who did we beat out to um, be able to win this? Very good friends of ours, some fellow Canadian craft breweries. So it's it's really a craft brewer um, event throughout Canada. We have some fantastic breweries, um, such as, you know, right from the, from the very east coast to Garrison and PEI Brewing Company, all the way to Phillips out in Victoria. So wow. Lots of craft breweries around around the country that are gold winning as well, and we're very privileged and honored to be a part of of the community. And really exciting for us uh, in Winnipeg too, because you're putting your beer up against the best in the country. Absolutely. And we got we got the golden mug. Uh, tell me a little bit about this particular honor. What's this guy about? Well, it comes with the gold mug. Comes with the gold medal award. Um, when we got the the gold cup, I gave uh, I poured our brewer Chris's beer right into the mug, and so it's been a little used and abused. But if you win a gold Gold mug, you should drink from the gold mug. A uh, very proud honor. Now, yes. if you want some more information about the great things going on here at Half Pines Brewing Company, we have all the information on our website at breakfasttelevision.ca. Coming up a little bit later on today, we're going to be heading inside of the brewery to tell you a little bit more about the queer beer and how they make it so darn delicious.